Alright, Moichimotsu playing The Legend of Dragons Alpha by a hacker, which I will note in this, uh, the, the description box. Anyway, yeah, this is actually, I had to, as you can guess, after the whole hack uh, bug issue, I had to basically restart the entire game, but it's alright. It I didn't even miss much, so I didn't have to do much. Uh, I hate when I run sometimes, I can't control myself. Anyway. Get myself some. You don't need, I don't need to get my any Pokeballs because there's not anything I really want to capture. Besides, this is so short of an alpha anyway. There's not even um, a first gym that you would need to possibly get another Pokemon. Which for Liquid Ocean, you uh, have to do that anyway. This is probably well, it'll be the second longest of the three parts of this walkthrough. But uh, luckily enough, it's not too long in the long in long anyway. Talking to Ash and Professor Oak decides to give us the puke dicks. Because he's nice like that. And Pikachu's. Well, if you notice my sprite, interestingly enough, for on a fun little observation, I'm stuck. I'm like frozen in place, so. That's funny. Anyway, we get to have a, a, a battle with Ash, who ironically has a relatively under level Pikachu for fighting Claire, which I would think you might need actually a higher level Pokemon, even if it was just one Pokemon, but. Hell, you could. Ash could have a level 100 Pikachu, and it wouldn't even matter. But you know, the whole theoretical questions of what level Ash's Pikachu is at this point or that point, da 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 da, da is pointless to me anyway. And it'd be funny if Pikachu Slam actually missed, considering it has about 80 accuracy, I think, but I'm not certain of that. Anyway, Ash hands our ass to us, and luckily we don't have to pay him any money because Ash is just a nice guy like that. And also, Professor Oak is saying, yeah, this battle is. Completely unimportant. Anyway, I don't need to battle any wild Pokemon. This is an alpha. Anyway, uh, da -da -da, they leave. Pikachu is behind them. This is kind of a split path thing, but a lot of times it doesn't matter which path you take, except for near the end, which I will explain much later, like near the end of this um, part. You can find Wild Spearow here. I don't know if this is actually modeled even relatively after um, the actual Route 46 in Johto region, in which case you would find Fampy and Don Fan and stuff, but probably not considering this is designed in mind for a mobile 5 Pokemon whenever it is you choose. And no, I haven't played this game in every parameter. In other words, no, I haven't played it with um, Gibble, Bagon, Dratini, or Horsey. I've only played this through with Trap Inch, so I'm, I'll admit I'm pretty lazy with that. There are other hacks that I will probably get to eventually, like Pokemon Toxic Purple, where I actually played every um, parameter possible. You have three possibilities of stars there, and I played with every starter. Anyway, back to the actual narration of this hack alpha. We fight a Caterpie, and he's cool, because... I always thought Caterpies did look pretty cool with the little horn thingy on their head, or whatever it is. Unfortunately, I have a trap engine that pretty much hands Caterpies' ass to it. Anyway, let's keep going and kick up Bugcatcher Eric's ass. No, Caterpie, no. He's gonna whine. Anyway, I think the split path is coming up. Oh, I'm not sure where, I have to check. It's not here, this is a trainer, actually. And it's, um,. I'm guessing he's a Brit or something? No, he's actually, um, an Aussie. <laughs> an Aussie, yes, an Aussie. They just, the hacker decided to put in a fun little trainer class like that for laughs or something, or maybe a serious, I don't know. I could have sworn that this was a Makuhita, but it doesn't even matter. And again, a Makuhita wouldn't have been good, because it's, bite is dark type, so I wouldn't have done too well. I'm not sure if I'm gonna have to. Well, I'm, yeah, I'm, I will have the time. I'll be able to get all the uh, narration done that I need to. Considering my videos seem to get shorter as I get closer to the end of playing the alpha, and I've only played and recorded two alphas, and it's torture sometimes to actually have to record them because when you record them in Visual Boy Vans, it slows it down to about half speed. It feels like sometimes. And this is actually the turning point here. If you go to the right, you can actually get some items, but I'll I get to it. Don't worry. But here's the little event that happens. I was concerned, I was thinking, no, I can't get over there. But, here's the little event that comes up. You're thinking, oh no, how am I going to get past these rocks? 
but you meet Lugia, kind of, and Lugia says hello, and then he walks away, flies away, boom, messes up those rocks. Um, yeah. Anyway, yeah, we can get up there, but don't worry, the next Pokemon battle we fight will put us in a better situation for getting back up to where we need to go. Because guess what this chick has? Well, it could be anything, that's the thing, I'll just... Uh, let me give you a hint, it has Poison Point. There we go, Nidoran female. Looks oddly like a... Uh, well, I, they're supposed to be based off of rabbits, it just occurred to me what they're supposed to be based off of. Anyway, oh no! And Poison Point... Um, there are a few typos. But that's to be expected. And uh, I hate to, I don't want to sound like I'm generalizing, but um, a lot of times the hackers that do the ROM hacks are foreigners, which is fine. It's actually a good entrepreneurial uh, creative process or something to that effect. And I can deal with it anyway. Do -do -do -do. I probably should have just let Trap Inch uh, faint anyway, but I was stupid and wasted a potion. Now, it's going to take longer. This could have probably cut about 30 seconds worth of the video if I just said, screw it. Here I go. Um, da -da 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 -da. And again, it was going slower when I was recording, so maybe it's actually taking less time. But I have to walk 23 steps, and I was getting impatient. And eventually, I checked to see, and I only have one HP left, and he faints. I panicked and lost $56. Am I the only one confused about that? What the Pokemon currency works as? Because it seems like its exchange rate is really broken. For example, if I drop $56, it would actually be closer to 28 probably, which is still a significant amount of money. I just panic and drop 20-something dollars. I drop almost $30. Wow. Anyway. Now we get to see the magical items that we missed this is kind of a walkthrough, but I'd just call this a uh, Let's Play of sorts because, well, this would be the actual, this would be the first actual Let's Play I've done because I actually play through the entire, I record the entire gameplay footage and I narrate on it. So this is an alpha, so it's really, really short. Those bushes could be hiding something, so we check. We get Great Ball, Lemonade, and Stardust. But that would be really helpful if this was actually a complete game, but it's not. Or even a relatively complete game. Anyway, do, 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 we're getting to the end here, I think, of this route. And, yeah, yeah, I think the vast majority of the rest of this video is just this Pokemon battle or two. So, you can cut off if you want. The next part will be the last bit. And it's actually shorter, so if you want, you can just go right to the next one. I don't know if I want to put, I, I won't put these in a playlist because they're terribly short. Not to mention the related videos should easily direct you to this third part anyway once I get it together. But anyway, and I hope you enjoyed this. And we'll just save, and I'm giving you kind of boring commentary at this point, but the next part will be a little more interesting even though it's pretty much the end of the alpha, so. But yeah, this is Muijimotsu playing this game, and it's Legend of Dragons. Uh, look for it on PokerCommunity.com. Anyway, see you later.